Hello YouTube, this is FS Farmyard Dog and today we are back on the farm. So um 7.56 in the morning. Uh, we've got a little bit of crowd cover and um the field of canola and barley that we planted in episode two and one. Um, it's almost ready to harvest, but it's got one more stage left. And um, today I thought we might get the, gra the grass cutters out and um, we'll cut some grass in field one. So I'll just drive the tractor up to the farm and we'll pick up the grass cutter. So I hope you're all okay and you enjoyed the first videos, thanks for the views and the likes, I appreciate it. Um, so I've got 32,000 in the bank, I've played it a little bit off screen since you last saw the farm and um, well I bought this mower pack as you can see from NI Modern and um, I haven't actually used it before so we'll go down to field one and um, mow some grass okay we're back down at um, field one I've just lined up the tractor and the cutter so um, I've just put it into field position. You have to lower it on the outside of the tractor, same with the front, and um, do a bit of grass cutting. So uh, we'll just turn them on. And we're away. So I just want to apologise for if you can hear any rattling or shaking as um, there's a heavy storm going over outside at the minute so um, if you can hear that I'm sorry. So um, since you last were on the farm I, um, I have a few uh, new additions. Um, I bought, I swapped our baler from the in-game baler to the McHale and I modern baler, and um, well, partly because I plan to bale this grass after we've finished cutting the fields, and um, then after that we will. Um, looking to doing a bit of silage for the cows so we can make the mixed rations um, so um, this episode will be um, a little bit of grass cutting and some baling and um, hopefully uh, next episode, uh, that'll be four or five, we'll be doing the harvest for the fields we planted up in episode one. And um, we'll go from there. Uh, a lot of you are probably quite excited at the minute as um, it's leading up to Christmas and um, hope you all have a happy Christmas and catch up with a, a lot of people and eat some nice food and have a generally good time so um, I'll just finish up this field and I'll be back in a minute okay so uh, I've just uh, cleaned up the field with the grass car and um, taking it back to the farm and picked up the McHale baler by N9 Modern and um, I've just lowered the wheels 
and oh, I've forgotten to attach the PTO. There we are. So, um, do a bit of bailing. So there you are, there's our first grass bale. It's uh, 2000. And um, as we're low on money, I'm unable to invest in a larger windrow at the minute. So uh, we're stuck with the messy grass pattern that I've got going on this field. But um, as we get later into the game, I'll uh, think about buying a wind rower. And um, I'll be taking up these bales to the, uh, to the farm or to the bale shed, I should say. And uh, I'll be stacking them up there. And um, they'll be going to the cows mix mixed rations. Oh, I'm sorry if this is a little bit boring for you, but um, I hope some of you enjoy it. So um, we'll be looking into silage next. Um, there is a cornfield planted down straight ahead of us here now behind us but um i think we'll we'll be making some silage out of that to get the first cow started and um off screen i bought a few chickens so hopefully we'll be getting some eggs soon and um they don't make that much money but every penny counts. So um, I'll see you back in a minute when we've got this field done. Okay so um, we're back on the grass field, field one, and all the baling has finished and the field's been tidied up a little bit and um, I spent more of our money on these Fleming bale lifters. They uh, just go on the back of the tractors. They're in the pack with the baler. Um, so yeah, we're just going to pick up some bales and take them up to the bale shed. I've, um, I've already taken one set of bales up to start off the edge of the pile, or the end of the pile, so they don't roll out. And um, I've just got the rest. So um, they have the lock script, so you can lock the bales into place on the bale fork, and then you just lift them up like that and take them up to the farm. So um, it's not a bad way of doing it when you've only got a small field like on this farm. and um, you don't have to travel that far 
Obviously, um, if you had to travel a bit further, you stack them up onto a bale trailer. As, uh, oh. Forgot to lock the bales. <coughs> Excuse me. Forgot to lock the bales that time. But, um, yeah, it's a lot easier than messing them up with a bale trailer on the fields. If you've only got a short way to go. And if you haven't got too many bales to transport, as you can only get um, four on the tractor at the at one time. There was it's also quite handy. You can shift the uh, bales around the farm easily, or around the yard. There we are. But um, they're relatively cheap. They're only one thousand. Oh. As you can see, uh, it puts quite a lot of weight onto the tractor, which why well, wouldn't be a good idea to move them that far. But um, yeah, as I was saying, they're only uh, one thousand two hundred dollars, I believe. So uh, they're not they're not um, overly expensive. So. If you've got a little bit of cash, then uh, they're a good thing to, or good addition to the farm. You can also uh, press X, um, so it flips it, so it flips the bales onto their side like that. That's what I did for the M ones, so when I stack it, they don't roll out out of the ends. Similar to what I did with the straw stack over there. This yard's a little bit tight with this on the front and back. But, um, yeah. We haven't got too many bales to bring up, so it shouldn't be too bad. Um. I'll be stacking these up with the green telehandler just there. I'll probably do that off screen to be honest with you. Because um, I'm, I'm not too good at stacking bales as we found out in the first episode. So um, I'll take the rest of these bales up and um, I'll catch you next time. We'll uh, end the episode here. I'm sorry it's uh, going to be a bit of a short one. But this was um, FS Farmyard Dog on Farm Simulator 2013 Let's Play Marshton Hill Farm. Thanks for watching.